So I have eight month old chicks. They're about four and a half weeks old that were straight run from Tractor Supply. Four turkins, which are also called naked necks, and four Easter eggers. So we're gonna look at these and see if we can tell if they're hens or roosters and then follow them. And let's do it. So these are the first two. These are turkins, also known as naked necks. And I think I have one rooster and one hen right now. Because if you look at him, he's got a big comb. It's starting to grow and you can compare it to hers who's still small and yellow. His is pink and getting big. And also there's a little bit of wattle starting to grow here on him as well where she has nothing. So that's what I'm looking at. One hen and one rooster. I'm pretty positive with these two right now. So let's look at our other two that I have. And I think we have the same thing. I think we have a rooster right here. We're going to wait and see though. A comb and possibly a little bit of waddles but you never know and this one still looks like a hen absolutely no sign of being a rooster so I'm pretty positive that's a hen this I'm leaning towards the rooster so here's our four two roosters two hens I'm gonna say and we'll keep following them in a couple weeks and look at them again and these are our Easter eggers and Easter Eggers do not get wattles, and so we can't look for wattle development on these guys. They have the little puffy cheeks, and these are rose combs, so they don't have the big tall combs. So right now, these are really hard. Uh, so far, I'm going to say they all have the potential to be hens. I'm not seeing anything obvious yet that says these are roosters. So we might be lucky, you never know. So let's look at our other two. But and same thing with these two. I see nothing obvious that says they're going to be roosters. So maybe we got lucky and we have four hens. That would be very nice. I'm going to insert a spoiler alert right here. We ended up with three turkin hens and one Easter egger hen. So keep following my guessing game. So now our chicks are six, week, six weeks old and we actually lost one of the Easter Egger babies. A hawk ripped its head off through the chicken wire on the tractor of all things. I've never heard of a hawk doing that. So I've added wire mesh to the tractor now. I've never had that happen in all the years I've done chickens. So I did look at it and it was a rooster. So these are the three Easter Eggers that are left. And this one I'm sure is a rooster because, and I, this one I'm sure is a hen, and I'm pretty sure this one's a hen. So I'll show you what I'm looking at to decide that. The first thing is their combs. If you look, his is pink. Hers is yellow. If I'm looking at the tip here, it's all yellow. His is all pink. And when I look at this one, it's yellow still too. It almost looks like it's growing a little bit, but it's still yellow. Where this one, you can see it's fat, and pink. This is definitely a rooster. And he's showing some signs of aggression too. And the other thing I'm looking at, here I'll look at these two first just to show you and compare. If you look at the coloring, if you can see on the top, let me fix his wing. Hers is nice and even. His is blotchy. So that's another thing I'm looking at at this stage. I can't really look at their tails yet. Um, maybe. But at six weeks they don't really have the feathering to look at tail formations quite but and the other thing is he's kind of a size bigger too if you just look and let's look at this one can you move the outside hand so we can see her coloring her coloring is very even too let's get her wing out here give me her give me her there we go if you look at her coloring roosters get uneven color take this hen that's a wing. Thank you. See his coloring? He's got different, darker. Hers is very even. So that's the other reason I think this is probably a hen. So the other thing I'm looking at on these birds is the hens are on the outside and the roosters in the middle. And if you look at their coloring, the outside hens, the coloring is more consistent. Where if you look at the rooster, you can see if you look at adult roosters, they have different coloration pattern. And I'm looking at him and I'm seeing rooster coloration pattern forming, I think. So that's the other thing I'm looking at with these birds. So these are my six week old straight run turkin chickens. And this is very obviously a rooster at this point. No hen I've ever had has had huge 
chrome and wattles that are pink like this. So when you see that with a six week old chicks, yes, adult hens get large pink comb and wattles, but that's at the point of laying around five months typically. This is definitely a hen. Yellow, very yellow comb, no really development to speak of, not when you compare these two. So I don't even have to look any further with these two. Definitely a rooster, I think definitely a hen at this point. And then these are the other two. And right now, I think I have hens, unless we have some really late bloomers. But when I look at their combs, I mean, compared to his, look, no development to speak of. And I still see yellow. Yellow. So I'm going to say these two are hens, even though I suspected the one was a rooster initially at four weeks. So we'll track them one more time just to be sure. At eight weeks, we should definitely know. So the birds are now two months old in one week, and so we're going to look at them one last time. So these two are definitely roosters, and what I'm looking at at this age, because roosters at two months of age will start developing like you're seeing here. The comb is a little bit of red and they're growing. And this one, you can see the difference when you look at them side by side. This is definitely a hen. Her comb is not developing hardly at all. So it helps really to have side by side birds. And then I'll show you what else I'm looking at to decide this. And birds are all different and breeds are different and so you just kind of got to put everything together that you see. So these two are roosters and I'll show you the other reason why. The next thing I'm looking at is their coloration. And this white one like we already talked about is real blotchy. But then the other thing that confirms it is roosters get different colored tail feathers and if you notice both of these have a green sheen on their tail. And I kind of thought this one might be a hen the last time, but then the comb started developing right after that. Like two days later, I said, oh man, that is a rooster. So their coloring is not as consistent and solid. And when you see the green sheen, because these aren't old enough yet to, to get the hackle and saddle feathers that you would be looking for on an adult bird. And so we're just looking for signs. And so the green sheen on a few of the tail feathers, I don't know if you can see it here. We'll put them in the sun maybe in a minute and look at that green sheen. That indicates a rooster too, that little bit of green just on the top of their tail. So these are roosters and they fight. The hens will maybe look at each other off, but they're not gonna engage in sparring like the roosters will play fight at this age. So that's the other thing you can look for. If you see two birds actively play fighting, that's also indicating that they're roosters because they start getting aggressive in that way. And they might even bite, but. So, and this is our hen. And you can see she's got real nice consistent coloring. There's not like green sheen on her feathers, even though there's some dark here, it's not shiny green. So we have one hen and two roosters. In these single comb birds, it is so much easier to tell your hens from roosters at this age because your hens are not gonna develop before four months of age. If you have a chicken like this that's under four months of age with huge red comb and wattles, that's a rooster. So that's really all we need to look at on these birds. They're all just red, so we can't, there's no coloration. But so we have three hens. Notice very little development. And when you compare it to him, I mean, look, very obvious. One rooster, three hens. So following these birds grow up, it's not always cut and dry, which is a hen and rooster before around two months of age, but you can start to identify the ones that are probably hens and probably roosters somewhat early on. You just kind of got to wait and see a little bit too.